What's up, real world? Twisted luck. Hope everybody's good. Thank you, thank you, thank you for being here. Uh, another one, another one. So I posted yesterday on Twitter that we really should think about uh, leaving a very good review for the makers of our crystal ball because, because uh, they did an amazing job because it apparently is crystal clear. Uh, it works so well and um, we really appreciate having it. So there's a, another incident in Tulsa, Oklahoma. Wouldn't you believe it? Wouldn't you believe it? And this one's prompting uh, the president alleged good old Joey B to address the nation. He's going to address the nation. This just has got to stop. This is just, we know what the problem is, right? We know what the problem is because just like with car crashes, the problem is the cars. It's the cars. We, we have to do something about this, right? It's not the people that control the cars because the car can't just make the decision to go out and do whatever it wants and wreak havoc. Uh, it's, it's, but apparently that it is how it is, right? The car decides that it's just gonna set out and it's just, you know, the car just had some bad days and the car is like, you know what, that's it. I've snapped, I've had enough. And the owner of the car, suddenly you hear your car start and you're like, that sounds like my car. And you look out and you're like, no, don't go. It's like, I've had it, I'm over it. I'm going out, no, don't do it. Don't be like all the other cars. Uh, and he goes out and, and does it. So, you know, much like that, um, obviously the problem is the guns. Uh, because with cars too, that would be ridiculous to say that the people in the cars if you just happen to be in your car when it does crazy things, uh, you know, that, that would be ridiculous to say that it's your fault. It's ridiculous to say that the person was at fault. The person did something stupid, something wrong, whatever it might be. The person operating the car, right? But isn't it strange? How, why don't we go after cars? Why, why don't we? Right? Because it's pretty much the same thing, right? And cars boy, they cause a lot of injury and death every year, right? So if public safety is really the concern, it would seem like you'd go after those. It would seem like, right? I don't know. Maybe I'm crazy. I'm probably the first first one to ever think of this. But uh, if that's really their, their goal, I bet they would save more people and protect more people by banning cars. I think. I think they would. Uh, and if that's really their their goal, then they should they should listen to us. You know, that's if that's what they want. So obviously that's just so ridiculous. But there's something crazy with this this Tulsa event. Crazy in how I found out about it. And this raises an eyebrow. This actually raises both eyebrows. Two of them up. Same time. Uh, my wife actually she used for a browser or, you know, internet search, I don't know, whatever, uh, Bing, right? So she sent me a text, uh, a screenshot. She's like, WTF is this? So what it was, there's a screenshot, or there's a screenshot, up here somewhere is a screenshot. Um, when she went to it, so neither of us had heard of any such incident, right? So she opens up Bing, and what you see there in the search bar, she did not type. What you see there in the search bar, you couldn't type over. Uh, it was like ghost text. You you couldn't. I mean, you could you could type over it. You couldn't delete it. It was there, so you could enter your search on top of that if you wanted to. But that was there, like ghost text, right there in the search bar. Seemingly indicating that they want to put an idea in your head. They want you to search for that. That's what I get from that. So right away, I was like, holy crap. Uh, I don't know, like, is this an indication of something to come? Because I've heard nothing of this. And then I started researching and I found that there had just been an incident in Oklahoma, in, in Tulsa. So why the hell would that come up with not typing a thing just opening the search engine or opening the browser and there it is right there in the search bar. 
already there, you've never even heard of such a thing, had no intention to type that in or look for it, but there it is. I've never seen anything, anything like that before. I've never heard of anything like that before. It seems extremely suspect to me. Highly, highly suspicious. I right away I was I was thinking if this is not a I was thinking maybe it's a thing from like long ago or something. I just I don't remember it or something. But for some odd reason it's a fluke and it's I don't know how to explain it. Or maybe it's something that's about to happen or going to happen soon. And uh it was almost like real time. There it was. It was uh it was just happening. There was uh reports coming in for police and stuff when I like when I researched it and found that there was such a thing uh going on or allegedly going on uh it was brand brand new but already right there in ghost text for you that you have to see there's no way you can't see it there it was typed right in there what's the reason for that I mean I want to hear your thoughts or if you've ever seen anything like that but what an odd thing to be in that search bar, right? Um, say it's some glitch or something. Why would it not be, you know, I don't know, some stupid meme or something, you know? You know, you know cute, cute cat or whatever, some stupid, you know, whatever you see all over the place. Why would it be something like that? You know, cute kittens, funny animals or something. But no, specifically those three words right there in the search bar or was it four I don't remember I'm not looking at you just saw it but I didn't I'm talking I'm going from memory three or four words whatever it was right there in the search bar that is highly suspect to me honestly I didn't even I've not even read much about this incident or what they're saying about this incident yet it just I mean it was expected and it's right on time and like I said the the president alleged is <laughs> supposed to lead and or uh, address the nation, you know, come on, come on. Does any, this is just, it's getting ridiculous, right? He knows, and they all know that we all know, but we're still playing the game because we're allowing the game to be played. But of course he's going to address the, na the nation because look, l look what just, just ironically, they happen to be able to use now just in the past couple weeks. Our hospitals aren't safe. Our schools aren't safe. Our grocery stores aren't safe. Our churches aren't safe. When are we going to wake up and realize that it's not the people that control the tools, it's the tools themselves, right? Well, you go, 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 go. God, it's like a barber, right? If a, if a barber keeps snipping somebody's ear all the time, right? Is it the scissors? The damn those scissors? Damn those darn scissors? Or is it the barber? It's the barber. It's not the scissors, right? But that's what they're going to say. Look at all these places where we just can't feel safe. Did you seriously just do that? Where we... Look, look at all these places where we can't feel safe anymore. And there's nothing we can do. Look, we have security measures. They don't work. We, we have police on scene during this. And... That didn't help either. We must do something else. They are trying very hard to get the support of the people, um, or enough of the people anyway, the people um, who don't know any better, the people who just watch the TV, just see the TV. That's where reality comes from, the TV. All you need to know comes from the TV, right? all these media sites they all have those sections like we've said many times all you need to know this week and there are people who only read that because that's all we need to know and they'll tell us the truth so everything I need to know about is there and all that I need to know about each thing right there for me look how easy I don't have to think for myself I don't have to go out and look at the sky I already know it's red because they told me and they told me about these crazy people who claim the sky is blue and uh, we should watch out for those people because those people are in danger and they pose a threat to democracy and freedom. God, God it's like painful. It's painful like how far we let this go. But this is a boiling point. Uh, again, like I've said, a boiling point and I, I keep saying 
we're gonna see more and more and more because they they're really trying to make a point here they really trying to they're either trying to make a point to get backing or they're gonna or, or they're trying to reach a point where they can play out the part of the plan where they say we just have to take these emergency actions now there's just nothing we can do about it i mean it's just too much it's just too much and also on a kind of related note do you remember back when the uh the mob thefts were going on they're still going on by the way they're just not telling you about it anymore because they've always gone on and i said that these things were groups of people rush into a store grab arms full of stuff and run out this has always gone on Year, for years and years and years has gone on right but they started telling you about it right they started telling us all about it showing us videos of it because they want to create the impression that suddenly this is something new and it's a huge problem and they're showing you more and more of it and you know what else that did you know what else that does that gives other people that aren't doing it the idea so it actually does increase once they start talking about it and showing it because it gives people the idea that otherwise didn't have the idea they're pretty stupid people but they were too stupid to think of a stupid thing right they needed another stupid person to think of the stupid thing for them because they were a different level of stupid i guess but uh and that's how they push things out there when they want and need things to happen they show them to the people they show them what everybody else is doing and that draws more people to do what they're showing and they know that they do this and they do it for a reason when they want to create something it's very easy for them to create something they just show it to you because there's so many things that go on all the time then when the media starts telling you about it it's actually old news but it's just never been news right and some people i mean I'm, sh I'm sure there's criminals that are like angry at those reports like hey man I pioneered this 25 years ago. What are they talking about? This is some new trend. But you see what I mean? You see the connection? Um, if they put it out there and they tell you about things, um, it's it's uh, it's going to increase. But what they don't show you on national news every single day is how in many neighborhoods there are incidents that go on all the time, all the time, by bad people, right, who don't follow laws so any proposed laws or restrictions will not apply to them like we said many many times that only victimizes a victim further because they can't protect themselves but i digress uh let me know what you think about the uh about that ghost text that is very very highly suspect to me um and these days you kind of have to be suspicious of everything because uh there is so much out there nefarious you know under in in the in the costume of a friend right in the disguise of something friendly or something other than what it is so that is just that was very i mean high level of suspicion in that to me and again like i said this was brand new it was brand new there wasn't big stories out yet there was uh little updates from the police you know police now report this police say you know they're entering the building things like that when it was already in the search history so we didn't eat like again like i said we had no idea it was even a thing so it's not even possible to have typed that in there and i should have had her make a screenshot video of typing over it and stuff but i think you get the idea of what i'm trying to describe it was there you know and you could just type over your search but let me know what you think of this sounds very suspect to me and uh, i appreciate you thanks for being here twisted luck truth i'll see you soon